Good morning. I'm Rena Ninen. And I'm Ryan Smith with the top stories on this Tuesday, February 24th. Parts of the South are facing another day of treacherous driving with slick, icy roads. There were hundreds of traffic accidents, and throughout the east, it's bitter cold. Today, many schools are closed and flights are being canceled. Meantime, road salt used in all these snowstorms has made its way into the water supply near Philadelphia. Residents in several towns have complained that their tap water tastes salty. Officials admit it is road salt, but that the water has been treated and is safe to drink. And in Boston, it wasn't necessarily slick roads that caused this pickup to slam into a light pole and exit sign on an elevated highway. The truck then flies off the upper deck and plunges into the roadway below. Amazingly, the driver survived. He's been charged with drunk driving. U.S. authorities say that despite a video posted online by Al-Shabaab militants, there's no credible plot against the Mall of America or any U.S. mall. But the White House is still encouraging Americans to be vigilant just in case. And coming soon from Apple, ethnically diverse emoji characters. The male and female faces as well as the thumbs up and thumbs down icons will be available in six different skin tones. The new icons will be available when Apple updates its iOS later this year. Well, get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm Rena Ninen. And I'm Ryan Smith. Thanks for watching.